Hey guys, um, I thought I would come on <clears throat> and show you some of the journals that I've made through the years. This one here was my very first one that I ever made, so it's kind of wonky and falling apart and not the greatest of things, but it was my first one, so I mean, I put uh, like different tickets of things that we, me and Michael went to. And I'm so glad that I did that now. I mean, not everything of is, you know, has to do with me and Michael, but I'm glad that I did something. Here I put just, you know, what I used to like from the 80s. It says love the 80s. And I've got like leg warmers, Rick Springfield, friendship beads, weeble wobbles, Saturday morning cartoons, rotary phones, Aquanet, MTV, Super Mario Brothers, Facts of Life. Uh, Alf, Tom and Jerry, Big Hair, uh, The Golden Girls, California Raisins, Highlights Magazine, Penny Candy Gum, Sun In, um, Slouch Socks, <clears throat> Candy Cigarettes, The Clapper, Roller Skates, Magic 8 Balls, Metal Lunch Boxes, Candy Lipstick, um, Hopscotch, Bottle Caps, just all kinds of different things from the 80s. And then there was another race that we went to because we always liked dirt track racing. <clears throat> Michael's a big fan of dirt track racing. He's went his entire life. His dad started taking him and his brother when they were young. And so we would always go to dirt track races. And here's uh, some stuff that I made out of stamps that I made from Fun Foam. So I made those and Stamps. This was like years ago. Let me see. Does it say what year the Johnny Appleseed race was? Because <clears throat> I don't think I put the year on anything in here. Let me see. Shoot. Where'd it go? Well. Oh, 2012 Indy Screen Park. So it's probably around 2012 or 13. Yeah, I would say it was around 2012 or 13, somewhere in there. <clears throat> Maybe 2015 or 14 or 15. But it's just a bunch of junk. And, like, that's why they're called junk journals. You know, you just put a bunch of stuff in there. I painted that. Little, I don't know, cherries or whatever. Here's a little envelope that I made. <clears throat> with washi tape and just um, paper. There, I just, I was gluing paper down. That's all I was doing, just putting it onto the page. Same there, same there. See, none of this stuff was like really finished because I wanted to do other things to it, but I just never did. There's another uh, dirt track race. Yeah, and I think that might, I, mean, I guess that's not all. There's a fish that I drew and painted, a goldfish. And then uh, another stamp made out of fun foam. And then here's my Walking Dead page. Well, Norman. Norman Reedus. I loved him. Daryl. There's just paper. And on these, when they're just the regular notebooks, I take and glue one or two pages. Well, no one or two. Two or three pages together. It makes them thicker and it makes them able to hold more things. But there's that. But yeah, that was my very first one. Whoops. And it's very old and decrepit, falling apart. <coughs> and here is, was my next one. This one I made out of a hardback book. And I just put, um, did I use, let me see if I used, uh, yes, I used 
<laughs> Believe it or not, I took some of Michael's boxer shorts because he quit wearing boxers. He started wearing um, the, I don't know, the ones that kind of are, come, they come down to your, almost like a biker short. He wore those for a while. But I took them, they were clean, and made paper out of them by just gluing down a bunch of paper on them and painting on them and it just made them real hard and then I bent them and cut them because they get hard so you can bend them and I just stuck them on my book and it made made the book but this one has just got a bunch of different stuff in it like that I drew this I drew see that it's just a bunch of different that was one of those ones where you do it with your eyes closed. So that was an eyes closed one. And I actually have a lot of the eyes closed. See, I took a lot of stuff from magazines <laughs> and glued them down. Woo! That one stuck. I drew this and then I just kind of wrote in her hair. Magazine stuff yeah. there. And then, there's an eyes closed, it even says right there, oh, this was done in 2015. It says, with wildflowers in our hair, let us dance in the sun. Oh, it's probably let us dance in the sun with wildflowers in our hair. <clears throat> there's that. That was a stamp that I made um, out of sun foam, the feather. I <laughs> drew her. Look at her hair, how big it like is off her forehead. And this is just a bunch of little different Halloween pages or pictures. This one must have stuck to things. Cause I got paper on it. Oh yeah, cause it was charcoal. Same with this. And this is all just like, <laughs> they're all old. She looks like an alien. These are all almost 10 years old. And I've got stuff, drawings from back when I was 13, 14. I don't want this to be too long, so I'm just going to, did I quit? Yeah, that was it because I stopped after that. There's that one. Here's the back. See, it started out just a black book, and then I glued that, those shorts onto it. And here's the dangle that I got on it. There's that one. <clears throat> and here's one. Whoa, what? Where did the... Oh, here it is. So I say, where'd the tie go? Here's one that um, I made. Me and my husband actually got into making these. It's just the decorative paper. And then we measured everything, sewed in our signatures, and um, laminated. We laminated it first and then sewed our signatures in. But yeah, this is just a little journal and I was actually selling them. I sold a couple of them, but and I just put different different papers and stuff in there and little pockets. But there's that one. <clears throat> and whoa. Here's one my husband Michael made and I'll never get rid of it. It's pretty pretty flat because it's not got a lot of stuff in it, but but yeah, he put a bunch of different papers in there and yep. That was one that he made. And here's another one that I made. And it's just got a bunch of papers and little books with paper that you can draw on or whatever you want to do. They're super cute. It looks like, <clears throat> sorry, it looks like the uh, 
band that wraps around it to hold it closed came out of that one. Yeah, like this. See, because I made bands to go on them as well. Looks like it came out of that one. And there's this one. It's got some pretty paper. My sister ended up buying one of these from me. She was like, I'll get one. I'll buy one. But I made these years ago, too. I don't remember what year, but it's years ago. And there's this one, and it's got a little bow paper clip on there that I made. It's just the flowers, and it's got the flowery paper on the inside. <clears throat> Same with this one. And it's got a little ribbon, ribbon here, and then a flowered paper clip. And it's got cute paper on the inside. And then here's another one that I made out of Michael Shorts. <clears throat> this one's pretty neat. I like the way it feels and everything. Because it was, um, this is just his shorts. It wasn't put on any kind of book or anything. This was just made out of his shorts. <laughs> See how it's, see, they were blue, and I just painted them, put so much paint on them, and paper, glued down tons of paper, and then made this. Very cute. Some of these, these, I think, are the ones that, because I used to be in a group on Facebook, and we... It was called Deconstructed Art Journals, or Art Journaling, or something like that, D-A-J. And we used to make these pages, like just one page, like this. That's one, one page. And it had to be a certain size. Yeah, she made this one for me. And we would swap them. We would make them and swap them. And they would all be like a certain size, so they would all fit in a journal if we so wanted them to. You know, but, but there's that one, and I love it. I just love how it feels. It almost feels like a leather. It's weird. And then I've just got that string to tie it around that button. All right. And this is one that I made. It's a uh, recipes, and. You can see that the recipes just kind of fit in there. And again, this is one of the swaps. We had a jar template that we all used. And we all sent each other recipes on these jar templates. But I thought these were so neat. I loved them. And I'll have these things forever. I'll never get rid of them. But, oh. Oh, 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 let go, please. Here's one that I made out of a file folder. The yellow, like, manila file folders that just fold. So it opens up like this. And then you can turn the page. Whoops. It's supposed to be down in there. And you unfold it. It's like an accordion. And it also holds a bunch of my deconstructed art journal pages. Like... You unfold it like this, and then you can open them up and turn them. She is my favorite. I love her. I actually, mine was, I believe, yeah, my, the one I made for my partner was her. It was called Old Hollywood was the one that I made. There's Dumbo. This is a circus one that we had to do. But yep, it just, oh no, that came off of there. I'll have to glue that back down. But you just fold it back up, fold it, fold, no, fold it in, right? Yeah, and then, no, that can't be right. Why is it not working? It's gotta be right. It's gotta be, maybe it's just so heavy that Thick. No, the oh whoa, that ain't right. Whoa, I did something wrong. There we go. Is that right? 
Holy cow, I don't even remember how it goes because it's been... Okay, there. I was like, oh my God, I couldn't figure it out. Finally got it. It's been so long. And I made that one with the big flower on the front. And it's another, yet again, another file folder. This one I don't think folds down. I don't think. No. I sewed everything in on top of the... I just made these pockets instead of folding it down. Oop. It just folds up and then I tied this around it. And the file folders, what I did is I just used my jelly plate on a lot of them and used my jelly plate to make the color. It's really, it's so much fun. I need to get back into it. And then here is another. We're almost done. Here's another file folder. Gosh, I would love to get back into these deconstructed art journals. They are so fun. I think they had to be like eight size eight by eight. And anything else was pretty much fair game unless you had a theme. Like, see, I think this one might have been Alice in Wonderland, maybe. Yeah, down the rabbit hole. See, these are all different ones. Like, here's one. And here's the other side to that one. It's in the back. And then here's the second one and here is the other half of it it just the way the way I sewed them in there's the other half of that one and that one and then this one it's pretty neat I love them I'd like to get back into that but I just don't know if I could you know, postage and everything anymore is... Oh, that's another reason we had to make them a certain size was because of postage. Um, the cost of mailing them. Because I'm pretty sure we had them, like, all over the uh, world. We didn't just do the United States. I'm pretty sure that we did them from everywhere. But it was a lot of fun. Okay think that might be all of the ones that I actually made myself and then we go into how long is this video I don't know how long I can't tell how long we've been going either well I'll try to hurry here okay let me put this stuff back up here all right so here is um Oh, what's her name? I don't remember her name now. Jane Davenport. This is one of her journals. But, like, I've done... Let's see, where are they? Well, like drawings, I've tried to do a little different. There's a spider. Um, <laughs> some of the stuff is just weird and just me playing because I'm not a very good drawer. I started to get better at it. I can draw eyes, noses, mouths, hair, heads, but when it comes to putting all that stuff together, I might as well give it up. I'm no good at it. That, I mean, I practiced and practiced and practiced, and I started getting a little better, but I just didn't feel like there's like fabric. I just didn't feel like I was getting anywhere, so I just kind of stopped and plus you know Mike whoops sorry losing Michael and stuff I just haven't been in the mood and then here's one it's a Molly and Rex I got it from Michael's a long time ago just this part the the book part everything else I put in like the signatures and everything I put in I drew her and painted her or color her with marker. I drew these and colored them. She was a watercolor, I think. Because she looks watercolory. I drew that spider. I drew that face. I drew her and I drew that spider. 
drew her, and I started to try to draw a cat, drew that eye. Yeah, and here I don't think I did a whole lot. Yeah, see, I would, like, use the lines like artists do to try to help me, but it just, I don't know, just, here comes my big-lipped girl. Talk about big lips. Woo! She's got some big lips! <laughs> And she was holding like a Starbucks cup. There's these two that I did with marker, her, and then she's just pencil. And then I did these three little girls. And that might be all. Oh, I tried to tried to draw her sitting. I think she looks okay. I don't think she's the greatest, but I think she looks okay. Is that all? Oh no. Nope, I've got her. And then that's where I was trying to use my chameleon markers. I was testing them. I drew those mouths, noses. I drew those two ladies. Colored them with marker. I drew her. I think I just used black pen on her. And then I drew all these flowers. Man, I need to get back into this because I had a lot of fun doing all these drawings. There's some more flowers. I always do everything in pencil first and then I go over it with pen and erase the pencil. Or I'll like erase the pencil lightly and then go over it with pen. There's some more flowers and rosemary and yeah. Is that all? I need to get back into drawing some flowers because that was fun. I've got her and her little ponytail. I got her. And her, <laughs> she's perturbed. And I think, I love you, Smitty. That's what I always called Michael, because our last name is Smith. Here, my brother drew this elephant for me. One day when we were at work, because I love elephants, and I love all animals, but elephants there for a while was my favorite. But that's all in there. And that, my friends, concludes my journal video, my junk journal, whatever video. Hi. But that concludes it. And so we are at 23 minutes, so that's not too bad. But I'll go ahead and let you guys go. I'll go ahead and get this uploaded and... I thank you guys for watching, and if you would like, um, if you like seeing this kind of content, let me know, and I'll definitely start making some more stuff. If you like, you know, seeing people's drawings or colorings even, like my, my coloring pages that I do in book, coloring books, um, I need to try to get back into that stuff, and I feel like if I have people wanting to see it, I would be more apt to do it, so, all right, guys. Thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me, and I will talk to you later. Bye.